Just know I sleep well at night knowing who I'm voting for. Tony Hinchcliffe. There's a lot going on. Like, I don't know if you know this, but there's literally a floating island of garbage in the middle of the ocean right now. I think it's called Puerto Rico, Hinchcliffe said on stage Sunday, eliciting mixed reactions from the crowd. This happened to persuade some of Trump's most needed supporters. Most of the electoral votes will come from Pennsylvania voters and the culture there is very diverse. Singer Jennifer Lopez as well as artist Bad Bunny have made sure to show their support for Trump's running mate Kamala Harris since the remarks have been made. Puerto Rican superstar Bad Bunny signaled support for Vice President Kamala Harris on Sunday, sharing a clip on social media of the Vice President's plans for the island moments after a speaker made an offensive joke at Donald Trump's New York rally, sparking outrage. The move comes as both the Harris and Trump campaigns have been vying for the Puerto Rican vote, especially in battleground Pennsylvania, where about 500,000 Puerto Ricans live. The campaign understands the large reach Bad Bunny has within the Latino community and believes his support could help sway young male Latino voters the demographic that has gravitated toward Trump. The campaign also celebrated Bad Bunny, along with Jennifer Lopez and Ricky Martin, sharing the vice president's message on social media. Despacito singer Luis Fonsi also joined the chorus of Puerto Rican stars sharing their support for Harris, posting a video clip of Hinchcliffe's joke at the Trump rally with the caption, Are you serious? to his 16 million Instagram followers. Tony has since posted in support of the joke as well as other jokes he made about different ethnic groups during his Madison Square Garden appearance. We are a week until the close for voting and not short of destruction to ballot boxes in Portland and Vancouver caught on fire. The assailant behind it has not been identified, but in both incidents, the same vehicle was caught on camera. Moving forward, all ballot boxes will have 24-hour surveillance up until the election. Thanks for watching and for more trending updates, subscribe and see you on the next one.